The building was open in April of 2009. It was built in order to accommodate the expanding activity in research and development as well as the need for student communal areas and as a way to provide uh, and facilitate the, um, and help the transformation of the economy in Michigan. Is this a microscope? Atomic force microscope. A lot of interesting and important research is going on here. Not only research, um, but also development of um, things that are will be immediately applicable. Uh, biofuels. And its um, mission is to catalyze new sources of biofuels. Could be switchgrass, algae. And the second floor is the nanotechnology lab where. It, some researchers, including grad students, are working on drug delivery at the cellular level where drugs are delivered and targeted to cancer cells. That's another project we are working on with uh, uh, pharmaceutical uh, department uh, medicine uh, uh, is to control the uh, delivery and release of DNA as a drug that it gets delivered inside a cell and the cell becomes a micro-reactor to make drugs. Three floors above us is the Smart Sensors and Integrated Microsystems Lab, and there they're developing many types of devices, including implants and sensors for detection of cancer. We're working on these chips, and every pixel will uh, receive the whole ultrasound waveform. We can know which waveform come from the cancer area. I think it's a symbol. The building represents a vision of what can be done. Well, I think Wayne State is a key component and player in the revitalization of, of the city of Detroit. It invigorates the city. Um, it's a magnet for learning and education. And also, it, we're training engineers here to be the next generation of engineers. More than 75% of the graduates um, work in Michigan and they become important in the um, workforce and the economy of the state.